What is going on guys and girls? My name is James Hothixy and welcome back today to Roblox. How are you doing everyone? Welcome back, welcome back. Today it is time of course for some more brand new Bee Swarm Simulator and today could potentially be the final episode we do in this update until there is another update coming. Now you may be thinking, James, oh my goodness, no, Bee Swarm Simulator. <laughs> the good news is Hopefully, there should be an update pretty soon. So, um, I think the thing with the Sun Bear is, it's actually been extended now for a couple more days to get in another Saturday and Sunday for players to actually get the Mondo Belt back. Now, I don't know if this is going to affect an update or not, but as I was actually, actually, you know what, hang on, give me a second, let me just pop this up. As I was loading in today, I checked the developer's, like, um, Roblox profile, and it says, update in the works goal is sometime this week but you know how it is with me so i don't know it's kind of like one of those i don't know if there's going to be a new update coming this week or maybe it's going to be next week um but yeah all i know is hopefully there is going to be an update sometime soon and uh yeah i've got one more thing in today's episode which hopefully we're going to be able to do so of course last episode we managed to get ourselves this awesome free mondo belt bag here um from the the sun bear so we've completed the sun bear quest and we now have this bad boy as you can see here it's in the shop um so can we unequip it and equip it yeah there we go so we didn't have to pay for this um it's 12 million honey as like an item price so um yeah i'm guessing like I think I've had quite a few people suggest this, and I think it's a really clever idea, actually. I reckon that this is going to be the only reward from the Sun Bear. So if you do want to get this for free, make sure you do the quest before the time runs out. However, I'm guessing that when the Sun Bear goes away and it's replaced with another traveling bear, I reckon that you'll be able to just buy this for like 12 million honey. And you know what? For 50,000 container space and some conversion rate, so basically, essentially, it's 100,000. Um, I think 12 million is a really good price. Um, but yeah. That's kind of in the shop, so I'm guessing you might be able to buy that after the Sun Bear goes away. Um, but yeah, so today what we want to do is we want to actually expand our hive one more time so we can get a 29 bee hive because we need another bee. We still haven't got that Commander Bee, and I really, really want him to kind of complete our collection. So currently we're one bee short. We have 28 bees, and we have discovered 28 types, and there are a couple of them which we've got doubles of. Um, so if we actually have a little look here... We have two ninja bees. I like the ninja bees um, because they... Um, do they have limitless... Do they ever get tired? No, no, they do, they do have they do have a, a, a an energy rating, uh, but they give you the the bombs, the blue bombs, which I really like. I like the I like the bombs because the bombs are super good when you've got the pollen boosted up. So we've got two ninja bees and we have two lion bees. Now, if I were to replace any of them, see this has a bomb as well. I like the bomb one, so I'm a little bit hesitant to replace those, especially because both of those are legendary. And we've also got two demon bees. Oh my goodness me. I completely forgot about the demon bee. Once again, these have bombs as well. So it's kind of like, you know what? These are kind of useful, especially in those red fields if we're getting our pollen multiplier up quite high. So I do kind of want to keep those guys. And then I think everything else we've got just one of, except, of course, the commander bee. And I really, really want him today. So, oh, my backpack's full. Awesome. Um, so, yeah, currently we are sitting on a whopping six royal jelly. And I know what you may be thinking. Oh, geez, that's, that's not going to be enough, James. That's not going to be enough. No, you're probably right. But if worst comes to the worst, I can buy 10 royal jellies for 400 Robux. So I think I've got enough for 20 royal jellies right now. Um, but I may have to buy some more. I don't know. We'll see how things go. Um, and yeah, we want that extra slot so we can actually not get rid of one of our bees. So the slot that we're saving up for right now, I think, is just under 25 million honey. We currently have 21 million. And we're also going to have to buy another basic bee egg to go on top of that. So actually, you know what? Let's just go and have a little look. How much is it going to be? Okay, so basically just under... So, so essentially we need 26 million honey. That's what we need in today's episode. Um, So what I'm going to be doing is I have actually been doing a few of these quests sort of in the background. So I now have 55 times polar power, <laughs> which I'm quite pleased about. And uh, yeah, I've once again got stuck on scorpion salad. Oh, jeez, the pains of scorpion salad. It's so annoying. Um, But yeah, I've so kind of been doing a few of those. So what I'm thinking about doing... I'm going to mess around with the field boosters, and it's something that I haven't really done too much about. So we, oh yeah, we can also do a daily quest, so technically, if I buy 20 royal jellies, we'll have 27 royal jellies to try and get a commander bee. Unless I buy some more robux, which I've got a, I've got a suspicious feeling I may be doing that. I don't, ooh. There's my server, oh jeez. Oh my goodness me, that actually looks so epic, look at that. I mean, that's just, that's just an instant, th Oh. 
Didn't even get a screenshot before it unfroze. <laughs> <laughs> that was cool. Oh, and I want to show you something as well. I want to show you something. Actually, uh, yeah, let, let me just empty this. Let me just empty this. Okay, 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 okay. So check this out. Um, so I've been doing like lots of flying around and stuff. And like, as I'm sure you guys know, you can get out of this map really, really easily. There's never really been anything there. Um, and like, if you go to certain parts of the map, it just puts you straight out. So for example, if, uh, you know, if I just fly out of this side, because you can do this super, super easily just if you use any of the cannons. But if I land... And I do a bit of running, it just puts me straight back into the beginning. Now, as I was, like, doing some flight, I was like, what on earth is that? And then I discovered, if you go, like, hard right from the red cannon, and you fly over the noob shop, uh, look at this. <laughs> There's, like, the individual sprites for every single one of the bees just chilling outside in a big line. Isn't it so cool? I mean, I wish I could get closer to these guys. It would make thumbnail making so easier. I'll let you guys into a little bit of a secret. When I do like a thumbnail with one of the bees in, I have to like maneuver the camera like this and try and get a bee just on its own. But if they're like clipping together, it's no good. If this stupid shy bee has made a load of smoke, then that's no good. If it turns its head, then that's no good. So I have to like painstakingly maneuver it. And they move really quickly as well, which is super annoying. So just as I line up like the perfect one for the looker bee, like something like that, he's gone again. So that's what I have to do to try and get the thumbnails. I wish I could like maybe get just closer to these guys. But yeah, this is really weird. So I was looking at these. These are all of the bees. Hang on, can I get a really good view for you guys? Oh, oh, maybe I've cracked it actually. Maybe we could do it like this. Ha ha ha. Okay, yeah, so check this out. These are all of the bees that you can get currently in the game. And then the ones at the end are super, super weird. I don't know what this is, but if you keep going, keep going. There's the bear bee. There's the looker bee. There's the music bee. There's the commander bee. There's the photon bee. And then what the heck are these dudes? What are these dudes? Are there going to be two new bees in the next update? Maybe these are just like placeholders. I don't know. Either way, I want this command to be so bad. But yeah, I thought I saw these. Now they look like looker bees, but they've got different colored faces, and I'm not too sure what that means. But yeah, I just thought I'd show you this, so you can go and do this as well. It's not like cheating or anything because you, anyone can jump out of the map pretty much. Um, but yeah, I just thought I'd show you that. I was flying over the top, and I was like, "Wait a second, what's this line of bees?" Turns out, turns out it's that. How do I get? And I, I want to, I want to get back out. There we go. Hey. <laughs> okay. So. We have, basically, just honey to gather. It's as simple as that. So, what I'm going to do is... Hmm, how's the best way of doing this? I suppose what we could do is we could go and hit a field booster. Please be the rose field. 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 It is. Ah, oh, it's the strawberry field. Okay, well, never mind. <laughs> so, the rose field would be amazing because it's super quick to get to. But, I have a boosted strawberry field, so I might as well just hang around there. I might as well use this one for 15 minutes. Uh, and then when that one's done, I can go and boost a blue one, or I can go and boost just a random field. It doesn't really matter. Uh, all it means, though, is that we can just get pollen a little bit quicker. So, uh, yeah, this may take some time. Well, actually, I don't think it will take too long. I don't usually prioritize just straight up honey. I kind of like to sort of go around the different fields, and I like to do the different quests, and I like to do the polar bear ones and all that good stuff. But, um, yeah, I don't think it will take too long. So, basically, we need, what, four million odd honey? I wonder how long that's going to take. I guess we'll find out. Okie dokie, so just a little update as to how we are doing so far. Uh, we're doing pretty good, actually. So I think I've been playing for... How long since I last talked? Maybe about 20 minutes or something. Uh, and I've kind of just been plopping around, so... I've been doing a few from the top field, and I've been doing a few from the rose field. And, uh, yeah, I think the, the coolest thing about our current setup... I know we don't have those, like, top, top tier arms, which are, like, 60 million honey each, which is ridiculous. But, uh, yeah, we kind of, like, um, we do get that instant conversion, which basically, although you think that you're getting, you know, 300,000, you're actually getting much more than that each time you go and you go and harvest. Um, so that's really good. It's kind of, you know, stacking up nicely here. And, um, yeah, we're pretty close. So we're currently on 25 million. So we should have, like, 25.3. I think what we'll do, though, is we'll go up to 26 million. So I probably just need to do another maybe couple of trips. Uh, and then we can go and buy the upgrade. And then we also need to go and buy an egg. And then we also need to do our royal jellying. So, um... Yeah, pretty cool. I'm excited. I'm excited. I really hope we get this Commander B, man. I don't see, like, I hardly see anyone with the Commander B. And I don't know why that is. Is it, like, super rare? It shouldn't be, because it's technically, it's uh, an epic bee. So, yeah, it's a colorless epic bee. I just really want the little hat. I think it looks so cute. So, yeah, I really want to get this, dude. Hopefully, we're going to get it. Oh, jeez, I really hope so. Please, Bee Swarm Simulator, be kind. Be kind. <laughs> 
Oh, jeez. Anyway, so that's kind of like a little update as to how we're doing so far. We're doing pretty good. Uh, we're managing to get a decent amount of honey. The only problem is now, and I was actually thinking about it, I was like, wait a second, if we spend all our honey now and this new update comes out, then we might be honeyless. And what about the new items? If there's going to be any new items, I have no idea. But don't worry. What I'll do is I'll come and I'll pop about and I'll sort of make some more honey and stuff. Oh, yeah. Apparently, all these people on the leaderboard, like these top people, are all like cheating to get their honey. I looked at how you do it. It's super shady. I'm not going to do it myself. It's kind of rubbish. But yeah, why can't we just have a nice game without cheating? I'm not going to say every single person, but I, apparently there's a few people on here that cheat, and that's really sad. Why? 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 Can't you just do it normally? That kind of sucks, man. <laughs> I mean, it kind of makes sense. Like, how would you get two billion honey? That's ridiculous. But yeah, that's kind of annoying. Like, I'm, I'm, I found that out, and I was a little bit like, oh, really? Really? I thought people were just playing legit, but unfortunately not. I'm not going to be calling out any names, though, because that would be that would be silly. But, um, but yeah, so that's kind of annoying. I thought I was doing well with my 100 plus million honey made, but no, apparently this is just terrible. But, uh, you know, I am doing it the old fashioned way, so I guess, I guess that's something, isn't it? You know, let's keep going, let's keep going. Anyway, we have 25.4. Oh, okay, so two more trips, I reckon. Two more trips. Uh, I've been kind of alternating the fields just because I kind of like to do. I wonder if we can get a boost on this top field. We do one, and please boost this field, please boost this field. Ah, oh, it's boosted the spider field. Okay, so spider field is white honey. Nah, we'll just leave that. Ooh, okay, there we go. We have our 26 million marker. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Are we ready to spend it all instantly? Oh, man. Feels bad. Feels bad, man. <laughs> okay, well, I suppose here goes nothing. So this is what we want to do today. We're going to open the shop up and the next hive slot, the 29th hive slot we are going to have for 24 million honey. Three, two, one, boom. The next one is 37 million. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. See, this is the problem. I really, really want 30 slots. We don't have 30 bees, like, the, like in total, but I really want 30 slots because then it looks even, and it's really, really annoying me that it's, like, one missing on the end or two missing or whatever. So, um, yeah, I don't know. I don't know, man. See, the thing is, if we're saving up 39 million, then realistically, you know, we're getting super, super close to... Uh, 60 million, basically, and then 60 million would be another one of the, um, you know, the arm pieces. Obviously, both of them will be 120 million, and that's just craziness, but it depends what they do with the next update, if there's going to be new bees or whatever. Did I hand this in already? Okay, I handed this in. So, I mean, currently, we have six royal jelly. Something tells me that that's not going to be quite enough. I guess I could buy some for tickets? But then I'm kind of concerned, like, what if what if there's a new item in the next update that might have tickets? Tickets are kind of annoying to get, so I thought, well, maybe we should keep the tickets for now. Anyway, I suppose here goes nothing, so let's drop our basic bee egg into our slot. We've hatched, of course, a common bee. Let's try these six to begin with. Let's see if we can get lucky with these six. Nope. So there's a brave bee. That's number one. And bubble bee, number two. Okay, here we go. And rage bee, number three. Oh, jeez, come on. Come on, Rad B, no! Why are you doing this to me, game? Please! Look at B, no! We've already got one of you. I know you're a new one, but we already have one. And... Oh, I guess it's time to buy... It's time to spend some world... Oh, jeez. All right, okay, fine. Fine, you win this time, Bee Swarm Simulator. Ah, oh, purchasing Robux and purchasing Robux. I wish I had 1.2 million Robux. Oh, jeez, could you imagine? Could you imagine the bees? Unbelievable. <laughs> it's amazing, isn't it? All right, okay, here we go. Let's go. So we've got 20 more goes at doing this. Come on. Come on, Commander B. You know you want to. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. 17. Hasty B. Oh, no. Oh, no. Rascal B. 15. Rage B. No. Come on. If we get down to, if we get down to five, that's when I'm starting to get concerned. Fire bee! Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Even if it's a legendary, I think I'm going to roll it, you know? I, I just, I feel it. I can feel it. It's, oh, come on. Come on. Ten. Nine. No, it's a baby bee. Okay, I'm going to roll it. I really like the baby bee, but... Mm, we've already got one. Okay. But cool bee. So we've actually rolled a legendary before we've even rolled this epic. Like, that's insane. Like, what are the chances? Come on! No! Why you... Oh, game. Please. Okay, now I'm officially concerned. Five royal jelly. No! Four royal jelly. No! Three Royal Jelly! Why? No! Please! Please, game! Why? I just want the Commander B- Oh, jeez. Final Royal Jelly, three, two, one, boom! <sighs> Why? Why? Oh, rest in pepperonis, my bank account. 
Are we gonna do it? We're gonna have to, aren't we? Ah, oh, right, okay. Twenty more royal jellies. I see I see what I see what you're doing, Bee Swarm Simulator. You're taunting me on the final bee that we need. Why you do such a thing? Oh jeez, okay. So I mean can't, I can't even remember how many royal jellies I used. I think I used, what, 30 plus? Which were all of the ones that we got for free. Yeah! Woohoo! Ladies and gentlemen! <laughs> we got the Commander B. He is so... Oh my goodness, he's so cool. Yes! Oh, jeez. Oh, don't play with my emotions like that. Jeez, Beast Swarm Simulator. Well, there we have it, ladies and gentlemen. We got the Commander B. Oh my goodness, his little plate looks so cool. Do you see his little face? <laughs> Look at that. You have 29 bees. I'm happy. I'm happy. I'm pleased. I'm pleased. Look at him. Look at him with his little hat on. Oh, jeez. He's so cool. Look. Do you see him? Do you see him? Oh, my goodness me. What does he even do? I don't know what he does. Let's find out. The Commander Bee. Okay. So, he's a Focus Bee. So, once again, uh, we can stack up criticals with him, which is really, really useful, actually. And he also does Buzz Bombs. So, a pretty good all-round bee. The only problem is, of course, he's a Colorless Bee. So, if you do get one of these guys early on, which... I, I think it's, to be honest, I think it's just random. It feels like it's random. Um, but yeah, like, so if you get one of these guys, it's not going to count towards your um, HQs, which is a bit of a shame. But he is an epic bee. He is the commander bee. He is one of the new ones. And now we officially own every single bee in Bee Swarm Simulator. So you know what? I'm pretty happy with that. Let, let me get a let me let me get a little look at you. Oh jeez, look at you. Look at you with your little hat on. You're so cool, man. <laughs> I love it. I love it. I love it. Well, there we have it. So now we are back to 1 million honey. Once again, how much money honey have we made in total out of interest? Let's go and have a little look. We have 113 million. Not too shabby. And we have a 300k backpack ready. Well, there we go. So, ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much for watching. I really hope you guys have enjoyed this one. If you did, please remember to poke me in that like button. And if you're not yet subscribed, go for it because we do Roblox done fun. But until next time, thank you once again for watching. It's been such a pleasure. As always, thanks. Rantio!